What we have seen in the last 30 or 40 years are tens of thousands of factories in America shutting down, corporations throwing American workers out on the street by the millions, and then moving to low-wage countries like Mexico or China. In fact, as I think many of you know, right here in Indiana, United Technologies is shutting down through Carrier, they own Carrier, is shutting down two plants, throwing 2,100 people in this state who are now earning middle class incomes out on the street and moving to Monterey, Mexico, where they pay workers there $3 an hour. This company makes billions of dollars a year in profits. This company was able a few years ago to give a severance package to its CEO of $171 million. But apparently, they just cannot afford to protect the lives of 2,100 families here in Indiana. That is, that is what corporate greed is doing in this country, and it takes place day after day after day. That's right. Listen to this, just as an example of what these guys get away with, the kind of greed. A number of years ago, there was a guy who was the head of General Electric. His name was Jack Welch. Anyone know Jack Welch's name? He was called Neutron Jack. You know why he was called Neutron Jack? Because he was busy shutting down GE plants in America. And what he said, he said, if I had my druthers, I would build our manufacturing plants on a barge and take them to the lowest wage countries around the world. And when he retired from General Electric, he got over $300 million in a severance package. In other words, these large multinational corporations whether it's United Technology, whether it's Verizon, whether it's General Electric, they could care less about the workers who built those companies, about the consumers who bought their products. All they care about is their bottom line, and if elected president, we are gonna change that mentality. <laughs>